Thank you for watching this short YouTube video. Uh, this video uh, will show you how to write a customer unpaid invoice. How to write a customer unpaid invoice. So this is, uh, I'm on uh, QuickBooks Online homepage. So from there, uh, you want to create an invoice. You pr probably already done it. That's why you want to write off that invoice. So I'm going to start with creating invoice. So let's say the customer is uh, let's say dead bid into prices. I already have it there. And invoice date, let's say 4 30, 2015. And invoice number is 1004. And the product and services, let's say it's the, the uh, maintenance type of revenue. All right, so 1000, let's say invoice amount. Okay, invoice amount is 1000. Okay, so now on customer pays. Uh, if I refresh this, I should see $1,000 as open invoice item. So here is 1,000 invoice, open item, and invoice is open. Okay, now you need to write that off. Uh, the first thing you want to do is you got to have a bad debt expense uh, in your chart of accounts. So here's your bad debt expense account so in order to do that uh, you go to chart of accounts from here uh, from company gear and under settings you will see chart of accounts right here or from the uh, uh, left navigation bar under transactions you'll see chart of accounts you can go to go from here as well okay so so you need bad debt expense account There it is. I'll say how I did it. Okay. So ex expense category type is expenses. So from the list, just select expenses right here. Expenses. Expenses. Detail type. It's right here. It's on the list. Bad debt. Bad debt. Your name. And bad debt expense. And save it. Okay. The next thing you want to do is go to product and services list, product and services. In order to go to product and services, uh, from the company gear, you just select product and services under the list, product and services, is bad debt. I'll show you how I did it. There's your product and service information blank page, and just add bad debts. Description, same. This is the one that goes to uh, invoice or sales receipt. Or any sales forms okay and leave price rate blank and under income account uh, in this case it's uh, expense write-off uh, so bad debt it's on the, on the list so this is from a chart of account just select bad debt expense expenses bad debt so this is the one you want to select bad debt and save it okay so you have bad debt as item in your product and services list. Now you're ready to create a credit memo uh, to that customer. All right, so in order to create a memo, uh, from here, plus sign, create customers, credit memo, create customers, credit memo, go there. Okay, and uh, customer is dead beat. Okay. And let's say you waited one year and you need to write it up. You won't pay. I'm just going to use uh, 5 1 2016. And the original invoice number was uh, 1004. So I'm just going to reference the 1004 1 as the customer uh, credit memo number. Uh, and then, so in product and services, last time you used maintenance. So in this case, this time you want to write it off as bad debt. So just use the bad debt item, and the amount is one thousand. Okay, save it. Okay, now let's go to customer pays. So right here, started one thousand invoice. Let's open. Now we'll refresh this.
as you can see here uh, it's zero balance now so it basically invoice and it should credit credit memo and it's gone and this payment is automatically uh, apply credits type otherwise you won't see this now this is the setup one in order to set up automatically apply credits from here uh, you go to the the company settings company settings and payments uh, I'm sorry advanced and then the automation automatically credit uh, credit this is for the customer side it automatically credit uh, the, the the credit invoice so that's how I, how I did it here the payments otherwise it would be one extra step uh, you have to do the receive payment it will basically clear these two off so now it's automatically did it so let's go to uh, the income statement and see how it came out okay so I did transaction did all dates and uh, maintenance revenues right here this is the one original one invoice created and then uh, we have right up bad debt expense right here as expense and this is uh, to write up this income so that's how we did it uh, and uh, uh, so click uh, uh, red subscribe button below this video if you want to subscribe our YouTube uh, uh, channels uh, YouTube channels so uh, thanks for watching uh, uh, this video. Bye.